Okay, aside whatever drama that you know was going on on the internet surrounding Cardi and all the stuff like that, I want to acknowledge Cardi's growth. If you've been watching Cardi B since Love and Hip Hop, you know that even on Twitter, she was very out in the open. She's gonna go toe to toe with whoever's hating on her, whoever is making up any rumors or those type of things. She used to be on it all the time. Now, I'm not saying that she won't put anybody in check, but I will say that now it's more focused on the music and the business and her family than worrying about what these haters got to say. And I feel like she took a page out of Beyonce's book. All while showing her growth, she still has her fun personality. She's still authentic. She still talks and give that transparency to a certain limit to her fans. And I think that's why her brand and her as an artist, as a person has been so sex so successful example of this is her walking the Balenciaga runway and then we see her not <laughs> fully walk it and take a detour like that's so Cardi B but we love it during Cardi B's TikTok headlining performance last night she said that 2024 she's coming even harder and I believe it I'm ready for it personally if she's touring I'm gonna be there a new album I'm copping it whatever I'm there. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Also, today is the last day to vote for me for the CCNYC creative class. So click that link in my bio to do so. And also after tonight, I'm going to put back in my link tree so that if you would want to, to close out your year, to enter the new year on some brand strategy, you open a new business or you're trying to just do a whole new revamp, get into a whole new era of yourself for the new year. I'm still taking consultation calls or brand strategy calls. You can book, or if you don't wanna wait till tomorrow, you can go to my IG and the link is in my bio.